Hi guys and welcome to my YouTube channel, Ron's Weight Loss Journey, and I'm Ron. Well, today is February 1st. It's also the start of a new month. Uh, if you're new to my YouTube channel, welcome. Please feel free to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel where you'll get my uh, latest videos and it helps my other uh, members of my community to know when I post a new video. Here at Ron's Weight Loss Journey, we try to post a new video uh, every Monday, Sunday, and sometimes two or three during the week. Uh, yeah, so just let you know how the, my month went for the month of January. We were going to do the keto clean here, but I really don't have enough money for that, and, and it was really a tight budget money for this month. But overall, we managed to lose seven pounds for the month, and I thought that was really terrific. Uh, so what did I do for activity? Oh, well, first of all, I do 16-8 intermittent fasting. Which that, but basically what that means is um, I eat two meals a day a couple of times between 11 o'clock in the morning, and I, uh, I cut it off at 6 at night, and I, I fast the rest of the time. I drink uh, water, a couple cups of tea maybe, my, my usual coffee in the morning, one or two cups, and uh, that's pretty much about it. It's pretty simple. I haven't really been following anybody's one or two recipes. I'm just making it simple to me, and... I measure out my carbs in a program called Carb Manager. I keep my uh, macros and my calories down to my uh, what I'm allowed. Now, this past month, since I'm down to 255, I had to recalculate my uh, my macros and my calories because as you continue to lose weight, if you don't do that, you don't need to be in a higher amount of calories as you continue to drop weight in order to be successful. So that's pretty much basically what I've been doing. Uh, so what do we do for activities this month? Well, we had a really good month. We walked uh, close to 30 miles. We were getting out there every day in the snow. It's snow days, not so snowy days, cold days, not so cold days. Uh, we went up to my favorite place, uh, Sholem Palms, one day, and we decided to venture out to the uh, reservoir area. Now, last year I had done that with my friend Mary and uh, my other friend Igor and Rachel, and. Uh, the first time I did it with Mary, it took me four hours to do that trip, and that was up and back. And but my friend Rachel and I go when I went up that day. I could, I, I I made it as far as the reservoir. I wanted to go up to this rock formation called Devil's Rock, and I couldn't do it uh, that that particular day. And uh, so when I went up there this past week there, or this, or this past month, I, uh, it took me only an hour uh, to go down and up and back. And, uh, and that was a three mile walk up and back. And if you just heard that kick in, that's my heat. So if you hear any strange noises, I live in an apartment and I can't really do too much about it right now. Uh, we're hoping to resolve that situation later on down the road with a studio, maybe at some point. But yeah, just letting you know it's going good. And I go out there and I take a lot of photography. Yesterday we went to a place called Barrett Park, it's one of our many hiking trails throughout our city. And we walked a mile around the perimeter, took some photography, a little bit of video, and then had a really enjoyable day. Talked to a few people along the way. I mean, everywhere I go, I talked to a few people along the way. They, when I was at Sholins, a couple of hikers went and took a couple of uh, photographs of me and. I take a lot of ton, ton of selfies and photos. Um, all, all I'm using currently right now, guys, is my smartphone for that, my uh, video, my photographs. Uh, I'm hoping down the road another stimulus that we're going to get a camera for. The, uh, I'm looking to get a uh, Canon uh, Mark 50 camera. They, they, the budget is very budget friendly and it's around six bills and it's very affordable. And I'm also getting a uh, a gimbal for my. Uh, cell phone and uh, so I could take some really good cinematic video but just let you know it's going good I, I, I lost uh, a lot of weight now I posted a photograph the other day 2019 I was at my heaviest in the last 10 years I was uh, 360 some odd pounds so if you calculate what I am today which is 255 I, I lost well over 100 pounds in a two year stretch and I, did, I really didn't get going on keto until August, and, and I was pretty much that heavy in 2020 for periods of time. So, so uh, I, uh, I, don't, I don't know why I never started keto up to this point there, but when I found Keto Rewind, it, 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 uh, I just didn't find it by accident. I, I, something drove me there, and, and uh, when I fell in love with Jessica Freeman's family and her, uh, the way she structures her YouTube channel and puts everything together for us to lose weight and help us to uh, stay inspired, uh, 
I, I just, I followed her and I'm, I'm following her. I went back all the way down to her very first video and it just cracked me up on how nervous she was. And I suppose, suppose she had no idea on uh, how many uh, followers she would have to, in 2021 and going forward. But, I, but every time she posts a new video, I'm always watching it. I go back to watch some older videos this, the, and, and a lot of other YouTubers that I follow to get cooking ideas. Now we have bought a Instapot pressure cooker there. If you, if you guys never bought one or are afraid to use it, don't be because they're really marvelous. And I, uh, I've only used it a few times, but I'm planning on doing a whole keto series just on keto meals with the Instapot, and that should be pretty fun and interesting. And uh, it, it'll be keto, clean, simple, and uh, and most of the uh, ingredients that you probably already have in your kitchen, other than the meat that you probably need to buy. But uh, that should be fun and interesting coming up. Uh, we're continuing losing weight. We went down to the gym a few times this past month. We did the, uh, the kettle ball again, or the kettle bell. And uh, we tried to do the smash ball a couple of times. I'm gonna try to go do that again there, but I didn't have my regular camera with me and my tripod. So next time we go to the gym this week, I'll probably use the uh, tripod and start filming. And uh, I love going down there two or three times a week. I've been going out walking almost every other day. Uh, what else have you got going on? Got some doctor appointments coming up this coming week and this coming month. And, you know, we haven't got too much more to add. But other than that, just to let you know what's going on. And I'll post some before and after photographs in and some of my journey trips that I did this past month to let you know that, that it went really well. My back is getting really much better. I wanted to thank you guys again for all the prayers that you've been praying for me so I can get better with my back. Uh, the 9th of uh, February, we got a doctor's appointment for my cortisone treatment, and hopefully after that, it should be all right for a couple more months until we get another one. Um, so that's it, and then we got a major snowstorm coming in tomorrow, and uh, so I'm planning on going out and doing some photography, and but safely, and hopefully uh, put them up in a video, with a little bit of video. But anyways, this is Ron. Like I said, if you're not a member of my YouTube community, please feel free to subscribe to this channel and share it. Post if you want to leave a nice post. Uh, welcome to do so. And uh, I always answer my uh, people that uh, make a comment on my videos. I feel like I said I'm feeling terrific. I'm down uh, 70 pounds for my weight loss journey, and as I continue to lose and evolve, I'm getting. Uh, feeling much better each day. I can walk longer without being out of breath now. And uh, yeah, everything's going terrific. And I just wanted to thank you that and close out now. I remember you guys are amazing and I'm sorry about the background noise, but like I said, we live in an apartment. There's nothing I can do about it. Have a good week and I'll, and I'll uh, share a couple more videos later on this week. Have a good, and uh, remember you guys are amazing.